Before tayo mag-start sa video na to, I'd like to thank everybody for the 5,000 subscribers, guys. Sobrang thank you from the bottom of our, of our hearts in behalf of my brother na cameraman ko and also uh, yung mga kasama sa team namin. I really appreciate you guys for hitting that subscribe button and sharing this to your friends. And sana magtuloy-tuloy pa. So road to 10K na tayo. So tara, simulan na natin yung video. Naghahanap ka ba ng property na malapit sa New Valley area? Well, nandito tayo ngayon sa Cabello Laguna to feature Camellia dos Rios 3. Hi guys, Armand Cruz here, your trusted real estate sales person. And nandito po tayo ngayon in Camellia dos Rios Trails in Cabuyao, Laguna to feature yung mga house models na in-offer po nila. But before I proceed with the house tour, I'd like to invite you to like, share, and subscribe to my channel para ma-update ka sa mga bago kong videos. Pero bago tayo magsimula, let's talk about location, the computation, and also yung amenities na kasama po pag bumili kayo dito sa Camellia dos Rios Trails. So number one, location. Sa Camellia dos Rios Trails is located in Cabuya, Laguna, pero napakalapit lang po niya sa New Valley area. Ibig sabihin, it's near the soon-to-rise Central Business District sa Santa Rosa. Actually, it's just around 5 to 10 minutes drive pag pupunta po yung Soledad Mall, Vista Mall, Santa Rosa, and Paseo Santa Rosa. And apart from that, malapit din po siya sa Qualimed and also Medical City. Number two, computation. Ang available po nating financing scheme dito sa Camelo dos Rios ay bank financing and in-house financing. With the down payment, payable up to 20 to 30 months to pay, zero interest. Number three, Amenities. Ang available po nating amenities dito sa Camelio dos Rios ay clubhouse, basketball court, and parks and playground. Now, if you're asking, na Armand, nasa niyo swimming pool? Actually, ito po si Camelio dos Tri Rios Trails is Phase 2. Meron po tayong Phase 1. And sa Phase 1, doon po located yung ating adult and kiddie pool which pwede pong gamitin ng mga taga Phase 2. Start na po tayo sa ating house tour. For today, ang ipapakita ko lang po sa inyo ay isang house model. This is their Ella house model with 5 bedrooms, 3 toilet and bath, and 1 car garage. But stay up to the end of this video kasi magpapakita rin po kami ng other model units na pwede nyo ma-view or ma-visit kapag pumunta po tayo dito sa Camellia dos Rios. Tara, simulan na natin. So I'll just give you the specs of the house. This is... Ang lote po niya, minimum of 110 square meters and ang floor area ng bahay is 100 square meters with 5 bedrooms, 3 toilet and bath, and 1 car garage. Tara po, ikot muna tayo sa labas ng bahay. So, for the purpose of viewing, hindi po exacto yung size ng lote ng bahay natin dito. Pero just to give you an idea kung gano'n po kalaki yung magiging lote niya, from this post all the way to the end post nung, ano, nung garahe natin, hanggang dun po yung lote ng bahay natin. So, ikutin muna natin labas. So, sa labas po ng bahay natin from the property line. Okay, so ito po sidewalk. From this line po up to the house, that's approximately 3 meters po na space wherein pwede kang maglagay ng garden or pwede mo siyang sementohan and pwede mo siyang additional space na pwede mong uh, pagpwestohan ng mga gamit mo. Okay? So, ikot tayo sa garage. By the way, dito po sa Camellia dos Rios or sa Camellia, uh, yung mga carport and balcony, is not yet included. Pero, meron po tayong computation na pwede pong kasama yung carport and balcony. Meron naman po tayo na kasama siya. Okay, so i-request lang po natin. So, as you can see, this carport can fit one car. Okay, so this is for the 110 square meter lot. And then, pagdaan po natin sa gilid, so just imagine po, a wall lang po to hanggang dito po yung bahay natin. Okay, we still have around 2 meters po of space from the kapit bahay para pwede po natin pag-park ng mga bikes natin ng if you have a motorbike pwede rin po dito and then pagdating po to sa dulo this is yung isang firewall natin 
Okay? So, this is covering some part of the house. Ngayon, since again, this is for the purpose of viewing, hindi po nila sinagad yung firewall natin sa likod. Okay? So, ikutin muna natin, pero hindi po ganito yung marireceive natin. Uh, usually, nakadikit po talaga siya doon sa kapitbahay mo or sa perimeter wall. Now, ang ginawa po ni Camelia for Ella, hindi po niya sinakop yung isang side your both parts. Ang ginawa niya po is may open po sa isang side pag dito sa likod at may open din po dito sa kabilang corner. So for this area po, open po siya wherein pwede niyo po siyang pasementohan, pwede niyo pong gawing na service kitchen or pwede pong laundry area. Okay, so tara, pasok tayo sa loob ng bahay. Okay, so as we enter, we are greeted by our steel door. So, ito po, sobrang ganda kasi maganda po kasi ang steel door, matibay po siya. And uh, mas longer po yung lifespan niya compared to solid wood panel. Pero syempre, depende po sa type of wood na ginamit. Okay, so tara, pasok tayo. Ayan, so as we enter, okay, you'd notice that this unit is upgraded and has... Uh, yung, mga, yung mga additions na po. So, just to orient you, for our flooring, this will be our flooring. This is ceramic tiles, 60 by 60 ceramic tiles. And yung wall po natin, hindi po siya ganyan. It's just, uh, that's actually upgraded. Uh, so, kanina kinakatok ko siya. This is wood na kinabit lang so that may accent lang yung wall. But it's just uh, plain white. And then for our windows, it's powder-coated sliding window. So, Para lang makita nyo. Ayan. So, taas na ko. So, this is powder-coated sliding windows. Okay? Uh, so, puti po siya. So, as we enter the house, as you can see, nandito na po ako sa ating uh, proposed living area. Okay? So, it depends on you. You're the house owner. So, nakadepende po sa inyo kung uh, what you will do with this part. Pero, uh, for the developer, ang suggestion nyo pa, you, you can do this or you make this your living area. Okay? So, as we move towards, uh, so this is the left side. Now, as we enter on the right side naman, is our proposed area for the dining. Okay, so it can fit easily a six-seater. Siguro, pwede na rin po eight-seater. Depende po dun sa size ng table and also size po ng chairs. Now, so as we move forward a little bit, this is our kitchen. Okay? So, ang kitchen po natin has uh, yung... Uh, granite tiles po, and then meron na po tayong overhead and pambabang cabinet. Pero this is, uh, we just have to verify kung ano ba talagang kasama, kung kasama tong overhead cabinets. So you have your space here for your rain shoot and also your oven. And you also have an access door going to the service area. Ayan. So you can have your dirty kitchen there, you can have your laundry, and you can also have uh, an additional room or make an additional room for your help. Okay. So, dito rin po sa may kitchen area is an additional room. This is the first bedroom of the house. Okay. It's just the right space is around 5 to 6 square meters. It can be a, uh, a ano po, bodega. Pwede po siyang room for your house help. Or pwede po siya talaga i-convert into a study room. Okay. So, actually, we have a surprise for this house. Ito po, this is the first ever house na i-feature natin sa YouTube channel ko, na yung master bedroom po nasa baba. Pero mamaya ka po siya ipapakita pag baba ko. Pumunta muna tayo sa second floor. So, by the way, we have our first toilet and bath located here in the ground floor. So, as you can see, that yung tiles po natin, uh, it's 40 by 40 homogeneous tiles. And you have your sink, toilet, and shower. Let's go to the second floor. Okay, so tara, akyat. So, I'll just give you an idea kung ano mga ginamit na materials for the second floor. You have your wood railings. Okay, this is wood railings. And you have your metal. Okay. Ito po, so, wood handrails. Ito po, metal railings po natin. And this one is um, wood. At the same time, pinatungan po siya ng laminated uh, vinyl, uh, vinyl tiles underneath cement. Okay, let's go upstairs. <clears throat> so, on the second floor... Uh, we have three bedrooms. So, this is a five-bedroom house. So, I just showed you the first one. And then, so second floor, we have four be three bedrooms and we have one toilet and bath. So, uh, let's just show it to them. So, it's the same. Uh, 40 by 40 homogeneous tiles, toilet, 
sink, and also shower. Now, as we move forward, we have our first bedroom. Okay? So, it's around 8 to 9 square meters. By the way, when you went up, when we went up from uh, to the second floor, yung flooring na po natin, nag-iba. Ang floor po natin dito is uh, vinyl tiles with uh, color gray po na it looks like wood. So, ito na po yung itsura niya upon turnover. And again, uh, yung walls po natin are upgraded, painted po siya, pero ang turnover po talaga is color white walls. Okay, let's go to the two other bedrooms here in the second floor. So we have our second bedroom or third bedroom of the house. Very spacious, around 9 to 10 square meters can fit can fit two single beds. So as you can see, yeah, and then you have a very big window there. Hindi lang makita kasi nakakover po yung, ano, yung uh, curtains natin. So again, flooring is like this. Okay, vinyl test that looks like wood, color gray. Okay, and the last bedroom on the second floor is this one. Okay, slightly smaller compared to the second bedroom on the second floor. Okay, so same, uh, same flooring. Yung walls po natin again is white. And, but this time, this room, if you opt to get the room with a uh, balcony or with a carport and balcony, ito po yung room na magkakaroon na access going to our balcony. Okay, so as you can see, very spacious. Actually, this can be another room. Pero yun nga, uh, some homeowners, because of due to the pandemic, due to the work from home uh, setup, they prefer keeping yung mga balcony as an open space and putting siguro on tables and chairs so that can, they can work there. Okay, let's go to our master bedroom. This is the first time that we'll be featuring a house that has a master has the master bedroom on the ground floor. Okay, so I'm really excited because this is for yung mga folks natin na medyo senior na, so perfect for them. So this is our master bedroom on the ground floor. So it, as you can see, it's very spacious. Okay, it can fit a semi-double bed. I believe it can also fit a queen-size bed. Very spacious po siya. Flooring natin is the same as the rooms on the second floor. It's uh, wood, it's vinyl tiles that looks like wood. It's color gray. And we have our own master toilet and bath, which is uh, almost the same size as the two first toilet and bath that we saw in the house. Okay. Before you go, we'll just show you the three other model units that's available here in Camellia Dos Rios.
very much for watching our house tour for today. If you like this video, kindly hit the like button. If you have friends who's looking for a property in the New Valley area, don't forget to share this to them. And also, hit that subscribe button so that you can be updated with my latest uploads. So, some announcements lang po. If you are a house owner or a build and sell uh, developer who's looking to sell your property, you can contact me in the contact information posted on the screen. There's my email and also my mobile number. And if you're a buyer looking for a property, nandyan din po ang aking email and also ang aking mobile number. Once again, this has been your trusted real estate salesperson and I hope to see you soon on my next house tours. Bye guys!